what's exciting about the Eco Challenge, and particularly the concept car category which we enter, is the fact that it's very open and it's, it's encouraging students to look to the future of what new cars may be like. We start at the beginning of the year with some drawings, some sketches, and we're following it all the way through to a finished car that we take you know, to Holland and test. In the car industry, sustainability and environmental impact is a significant factor. So the students at Aston here have looked at sustainable production, and our car uses sustainable wood sources for that. This is an interesting material which we've worked with, a sheet of quite thick balsa wood sandwiched between two very thin layers of plywood. And each of the elements of this material, on their own, are quite weak. You could quite easily snap the plywood or the balsa wood with your fingers. But when you bond it together, you actually get a very stiff material and you can support quite a lot of weight on this. The bulk of the car is made out of flat sections. You form a, a complex 3D shape, but in fact, most of this has been cut out of one sheet of plywood. So, in terms of sustainability, there's a big advantage to using the wood as part of the design, but there's other advantages that aren't immediately apparent. For example, when you use a, a flat sheet, there's quite a small amount of wastage in terms of material. We've used it quite efficiently. One of the more interesting features of this year's car is that we have full suspension front and rear. Now most teams don't attempt this because it's, a, it's quite complicated to put into the car. As well as the comfort factor, it also increases the longevity of all the components in the car because they're not subjected to the vibrations that the road would otherwise cause. We're using hydrogen power. So basically the hydrogen is turned into electricity and that drives our vehicle. We chose hydrogen this year mainly because of the ethos of our car being a sustainable car. Um, the fact that the hydrogen fuel cell emits nothing other than water makes it perfect um, for our sustainable credentials. It's exciting because it's new technology. It's not been done that much and we're trying to do something new. Combine this with our vehicle itself and you've got something incredible. We've made a wheel um, entirely out of wood, or almost entirely. The wheel as a, as a designer has got no straight lines in it at all. One of the biggest problems with wheel building is, um, is creating some kind of tension in the spokes. So the solution is, is that all of these members are bent. These are very thin um, plywood laminated up into this curve. So this wheel as it is, it has got tension in the spokes. It's very strong, it can take uh, over 100 kilos at the hub. I feel confident that we can definitely run a car on, on four of these wheels without any problems at all. All of our team are undergraduates when they join and they travel through their final year of university working on the Shell Eco Marathon project. Last year's team came away with the Eco Design Award which we were really very proud of but significantly all of those team members went on to either jobs or higher education. I've had the opportunity to design something completely new that maybe no one's ever done before and that's really exciting and a really good opportunity. 